Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Eileen with Unique Gifts and Decor by Lady Di. I hope everyone had a wonderful Merry Christmas. Um, I hope you all got everything you wanted under the tree. I'm pretty sure you all put smiles on a lot of people's faces with your gift baskets, your gifts, your different designs. I mean, it was a beautiful day yesterday, even though it was a little rainy here and there here in North Carolina. But overall, Christmas is a great season to see family getting together, eating, watching the football games, exchanging gifts, whatever you did. I hope you all enjoyed um, your time yesterday. But today I went out this morning and I was trying to hit some of the stores um, to see if there's anything that I could use today um, to what my gift baskets for Valentine's Day. And um, I hit a few stores and I have a small haul here. I mean, it's small, you guys. Um, I was very disappointed um, when I went into Burlington. We have two Burlingtons here in Greensboro. And I went to both locations and the store was really skimpy with all the items. There were no bath robes and the, you know, the slipper sets that, that was out there last year. Um, it was just really, um, the word is pitiful, okay? But in, I'm trying to see the good part about the whole matter is um, the economy is bouncing back. And that's a good thing because we need that. Um, the consumer spending uh, over the holidays, probably from um, Black Friday up until, um, um, I'll probably say uh, Christmas Eve, um, it probably went off the uh, scales, the consumer pricing index, because a lot of things are not in the stores. Um, basically, usually Burlington has a lot of the um, gift sets left over, but there was nothing there, you guys. I was a little disappointed, but, you know, as I said earlier, the economy is coming back. Now, the grocery prices are still up there. Gas prices are down. They just need to work on the grocery prices, and then hopefully we'll be back to normal in 2024. So let me go over and show y'all some of the stores that I went in and the things that I picked up. So here is for the items that I got at Burlington. Okay, so it's just um, a few things. Um, I got these picture frames. One was $1.99. And the other one was $2.99. They're, they're beautiful frames. And I can definitely see me putting those in uh, a gift basket. Um, it might not just be Valentine's. It could be one of the closing baskets. I found this slipper set. The only one, you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Let me go back. Um, the picture frame was $1.99 for this one. The larger one was $2.99. Now, this uh, BB Cosmic Val uh, Vanilla Foot Scrub and the Foot Lotion with the slippers is the set. It was half, everything was half price. So this was $6.49, originally $12 and some change. I also found this BB um, in its little low hand, hand soaps. I'm just gonna hand lotions. I think it's like it's five, one, two, three, five here. And it was $3.99. So it was, the packaging was, it was a little open. I think, it, I think it's made that way. It should have been, um, glued down but i'm gonna you know i'm gonna work that out and then i found these three um they're called the uh lux luxury gift boxes and it has the bath salts the bath lotions and the shower get, get gel in this one i love the packaging so um i've got some thing in mind how i'm going to use this but this one was six dollars and 49 cents again everything was 50 percent off then they have the, um, this is the magnolia flowers on this one. And this one has the Christmas holly. It's the vanilla and ginger um, scents. It does have the uh, liquid soap there, the body lotion, and the shower gel on this one as well, okay? With the holly as the uh, flowers. And this one here is um, the Tuscan Roses. Um, it has the shower gel, the liquid soap, and the body uh, lotion. So all of those basically, this they were six dollars and forty nine cents for those two, and this one was five dollars and forty nine cents. So this was a little um, less expensive, but again, that's all I got you guys at Burlington. Um, like I said, I I did saw one of the um robes but it had a stain on it It was on sale for i think it was seven something but as it looked like something had melted or had got on on the uh robe and it had a big stain on there so you know we can't have faulty material going out so 
I didn't get that as well. So, but those are my Burlington items that I got today. Now let's go over here. I did hit Hobby Lobby and my God, Hobby Lobby was so crowded. It was ridiculous. I was, today I was really going out to get maybe candles, um, ribbon, you know, for the holidays. And I am changing one of my centerpieces here in my uh, kitchen. So I did get this stemware and every, these were 66% off. And they did, I picked up some red tool. Now, um, they had 40% off the ribbon and trim. So this was over there in the area with the ribbon. So I learned something, you guys. Anything that has a price, the lady was saying it has $1.99. It says your price on there. That's the price. They will not take the 40% off of that. So I learned something new in Hobby Lobby. I didn't know that. I, I don't go all over there that often, but I learned something new today. So if, it ha if anything has your price on there, Whatever that price is, it's what it is. Even though the sign may say 40% off or 50% off, you're going to pay the $1.99, okay? So those are the only two items I got at Hobby Lobby. They was crowded. They didn't have any ribbon. They did have, well, let me go back. They did have that red and black ribbon or the red and, um, the red and black and the black and white ribbon. But I already have plenty of those. All that ribbon they had for Christmas, you guys, was gone. So, um... I know Hobby Lobby has a lot of that stuff, you know, the ornaments, um, all those bowls, you know, dinnerwares and everything for Christmas. I mean, it was out there, but I don't need none of that stuff, you guys. I have plenty. So, again, I was strategically shopping for certain items. Then I went to Roses, one of my little stores that I go to, and they had these items here. So, um, they had these chargers. They were 50% off, so I got one of the... Ten, uh, let's see. Well, I want to say an aqua color, maybe sea foam, and then they had one of the green ones. So those were originally a dollar. I got both of those for fifty cents, which made the dollar. Okay. They had these velvet throws. Now and I know I have a lot of throws already, but I needed some white ones. I have a lot of the red ones, the red and black ones. You know, um, gosh, a lot of the ones that's for Valentine's Day, really the reds. But I needed some, I do have some blues as well, but I need some white ones. So these says originally $4.99 and they rung up $2.50. So I got two of those and then I got um, the ivory, one's white, one's ivory. Then I got two of the pink ones. Um, they said originally $4.99, rang up $2.50. So if you see those, if you need those that you didn't get any at the Dollar General, if you have a roses in your area, that's a good place to go to. Also, I... Got some more of these bubble baths. Um, these are the red ones, the fresh raspberry frambos. Well, it's honey, it's 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 bubble bath, but got this French name on it. Okay, um, they were a dollar ninety nine for each bottle. So um, I know I have some pinks. I don't think I have any reds. I might have a few, but I don't I don't think I have any reds. But um, for two dollars, that's not bad there. So then I went to Walmart. I hit two Walmarts today, you guys. And, of course, they had 50% off all their Christmas items as well. But, again, certain things I was looking for. Um, now, I did not get a lot of the bears when they had them last Valentine's Day. I didn't do that. I just started doing my street sales in Mother's Day. So I didn't uh, take advantage of the after Valentine's Day before everybody got the bears for, you know, 50 cent or whatever, you know, but um, I have a few bears. I don't have many. So I picked up these items. I did get some ribbon. Um, they Everything was half price. So this was $4.95, $4.97, excuse me, I said $5. So it's $2.50 basically um, for all of this ribbon here. And I am trying to look at the red and co red colors, the whites, the pinks. But they did have these teal colors here. I would say teal. Let me see. Let me say aqua. I don't know. But these were two forty eight, so they were like a dollar twenty four piece for both of those. Now I saw these little plush animals. Um, they were originally three forty eight. I got these for a dollar seventy four. Got pretty many of those that I think would go in with my baskets. And I was looking for some white towels. Now, I got these towels as well. Um, was it doing Black Friday? They had some more. And these was $1.74 with the little uh, gray stripes on there. So, um, I put these in that uh, 
custom basket that I did for uh, one of my customers. So I thought I, since they had some, I thought I would get some more, but they are very nice quality uh, bath towels, okay? So last but not least, uh, well, no, two other stores. I went by the Dollar General because I was looking for candles and ribbon mace, basically. Um, really didn't see anything I wanted. I just went to uh, $1 General. I didn't go to any of the other ones because, you know, I can all, all this week, you know, they have that 50% um, off. But these might um, go to 70% um, next week. I'm not sure. But I can always pick up ribbon. So I did pick up the red and white here. And they were $2 originally. I got these for a dollar. Um, this silver, they were a dollar. I got it for 50 cents. And I've got these two red ones here for 50 cents each. And this one with the little um, white dots on there, this was $2 originally. I got it for a dollar. And this wider ribbon, the red one, it was $3, but I got them for $1.50. So those are all the ribbons that I got from the Dollar um, General. Now, these rest of the items, um, as you all know, I am shopping for Valentine's Day. So um, Dollar Tree, this is where I got these items for. Dollar Tree is putting out the Valentine's. So I was looking for some bears, even though they're the smaller bears. Um, this is something that I am going to use um, in my baskets. So these are $1.25. They had the white ones. Um, they had the pink ones. They're, they're a little cute. Um, you can probably put them on the side of a cup if you're doing it, or you can put it in a small basket. I mean, you know, you can, all different um, concepts you can use these with. They had the tan ones as well as the red ones. Now, they also have these felt stickers that I got. Um, I have some on the maybe the boxes that I'm wrapping, um, I might can put these on there. Um, I have those brown storage uh, crates, and I have an idea in my head how I'm going to use it, but um, we'll see. But I have a backup just in case, okay? And I have the they have these ribbon here, the um, heart ribbon. All this is Dollar Tree, and I did get these uh, vinyls. I can use in my creek my creek creek cut. And um, so what I'm going to do is um, maybe do some wording or something to put on the boxes or whatever. But um, I did get the white, the red, and the pink, okay? So you guys, also at the Dollar Tree, um, I got these bears. Um, a lot of people, um, again, got the bears when they were little for nothing. I didn't take advantage of that back then. But um, I found these bears. They are big, nice, quality size bears at the Dollar Tree, okay? They were $5. It's not bad for this bear. I mean, it's a big bear. So they had these in all colors. They had them in the grays, and I got four of the gray ones. And they had them in the browns. I think these are so cute. Here, I got five of those. And it's only, it's weird because it's only one Dollar Tree that has them that I've seen out. So, you know, the others are probably hadn't started getting the stock out. But every time I go there, and it's a big Dollar Tree, so it's a very nice one. And they have it in the brown. Every time I go in there, if I see the bears, I'm picking up the bears. So, I think I've got 11 of them here, plus my small ones, plus the ones I already have already in my garage, in my stockpile. But, you guys, this is what I found this morning. It's not a great big haul. But it's some things that are out there. If you all's Burlington has those items, you all need to get up and get out as soon as you can. Because here in North Carolina, everything is very, very slim. If you do have a Hobby Lobby, definitely go there to get that ribbon if you can find it. As well as um, Hobby Lobby. If you have roses in your area, um, they do have some good sales there as well as Walmart. If you can find certain things that you're looking for, by all means, pick it up. But you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, please like, share, and comment. Um, I have some more coming out. I haven't been MIA. I've just been um, doing some uh, street sales, had my gift uh, showing. Uh, people was coming from Sunday up until Thursday. Friday, every time I got off on my street sale, somebody was meeting me here at the house uh, up until 
uh, really Sunday was the last day the people was buying my items. And I feel blessed and I'm thankful for the customers. But you guys, be blessed and have a good day. And until the next video, talk to you later. Goodbye.